Hello again. This is Jan's Mix again, and we are playing Cultures 2 again. Surprise, surprise. And this time it's take on Italy. The Vikings land on the coast on Italy to gather the coast of Italy to gather supplies. Everything seems quiet and peaceful until until mysterious free dots happen. So for a long time, we sailed in adverse winds and fought treacherous currents, rounded Spain, and faced grave danger to cross the Strait of Gibraltar, where a sudden thunderstorm nearly succeeded in shelling us against the cliffs. We escaped by a hair's breadth, but our sail was torn and tattered, and our men had grown weary. Hmm. Grown weary. We remained adrift for a few days, then decided to head for the coast of Italy to recover and gather supplies. Makes sense. The women set up camp, while we men went out to hunt. Makes sense, Italy is in the peninsula, but what doesn't make sense... Yeah, you sent all the men to hunt. Uh, not only, for example, soldiers, for example, scouts, for example, hunters, but also civilians. What was that? Screams coming from the direction of our camp. Dropping our back, we run back to our woman who had remained in the camp, alone and defenseless. Oh, that's it. that is quite sexist. Okay, attack those assholes. Hey, hey! It was too late. From a distance, we saw wild Saracens dragging our woman into, onto our ship and vanishing on the endless sea. Our ship? It's their ship, right? Anyway, we found a message in the mine house. Mine house, I probably mean this warehouse, uh, because I don't have, I don't have a headquarters here. They were demanding a large sum of gold as a ransom. We would have to pay it if we ever wanted to see our wives again. Yet there was no gold to be mined anywhere around us. Maybe we would be able to persuade the locals to aid us against the Saracens. Give the Saracens a ransom of 50 gold pieces, or find another way to receive the Viking women. Okay. Okay. Simple. Saracens hostile, and I either need to pay them uh, 50 gold coins. Wow, oh, 50. Really? 50? That's a lot. Yeah, or just, uh, or just uh, free, free the min women, meaning fighting the, uh, fighting the Saracens. But I don't need to necessarily f uh, fight them. However, those are the basic two objectives on this uh, of this mission. Uh, so basically, we have a very clear goal from a day one, which is the reason why I remember. That mostly uh, after I quite struggled time-wise with uh, Normandy and England, I always remember that I actually finished this mission rather quickly. Okay, Napoli. Uh, our scouts were greeted kindly when they came across a Frankish village nearby. A trade agreement was immediately offered to us. Yeah, from the Napoli, and there will be another towns later I believe yeah uh, with them I can actually try to get the coins but 50 it's still quite a lot and what what do they offer one coin for for two honey for flour or three wooden tools those are actually quite good offers those uh, those goods which they demand are not that complicated, but uh, mainly because I actually mostly uh, finished this mission uh, by paying them. This time I think it will be interesting to actually win, uh, win uh, by a military way. So basically just by, uh, just by uh, freeing the women. And I remember I was trying that this this machine can actually be is uh, be easily rushed. I could just take my soldiers, hop on a ship, 
and uh, actually uh, free the woman which is not that hard because uh, because they are actually imprisoned in a spot on the on the edge of the village but they are kind of in a kind of funny way guarded by lions yes lions but it is not that they will be in uh, on the edge of the on the edge of the village so I definitely don't need to uh, destroy their entire village uh, in order to win this mission but but I will do so I will do so so it will be more interesting at least However, in, uh, in this mission there is also a side mission or a dungeon if you want when I will actually find the second hero of the campaign the Sigurd and I, uh, ironically, although it actually, actually is not necessary for the completion of this mission I mean, even hypothetically, even uh, even without doing the side, side mission it will be possible because I will get I think I will get few women after that, uh, so I can actually expand my people. Uh, but yeah, what is funny is that the game actually expects me to uh, do a side task with Sigurd, although I don't have to, because in the next mission I normally have Sigurd from the beginning. However, Roma or Rome, maybe the next great city on this stretch of land lay on a hill, surrounded by a high wall. Before we are permitted to see the mayor, we had to go through a heavily guarded gate and pass countless guards. The mayor said, our city itself lives in a fear of the Saracens, and we will not support you in battle. Those brigands are too dangerous. Like, seriously, you are a fucking Rome, and th those Saracen is just why well, not not at the village anyway the mayor said oh yeah uh, but we would give you gold if you freed us from um, from the monster in the nearby cave in the north it has been rampaging here for ages so yeah so yeah that is Rome I'm not sure if uh, canonically Rome is situated uh, by such a lake but anyway do they have some offers yeah also quite good actually quite good ones okay there are some wolves around here and yeah this is the cave we found the entrance to the monsters cave in the north as the citizens have described it, a ghastly whispering and moaning reached our e ears. I volunteered to enter the cave alone. Drawing Wieland's magic sword, I began to descend. My Vikings remained to guard the entrance. Yeah, very wise, Bjarne, very wise. The monsters then. I had not long climbed into the mouth of the deep when I discovered the source of the sounds. Close to the entrance covered a heavily armed giant of a man, fear written plainly in his every feature. His voice shook as he warned, warned me. Deep within this cave, within the cave, dwells an evil, terrible monster. We mo the most fearsome beast I have seen in all my years as a dragon slayer. It is so heinous and hideous to look upon that all who see it are turned rigid with fright. Though his tears chattered with fear, he insisted on accompanying me, as I continued nervously. Find the monster in the maze and face it. So yeah, that's the other hero, Sigurd. And <laughs> I just noticed it was actually mentioned he is a dragon slayer. <laughs> It's quite funny because I believe this game, I mean Cultures 2, is supposed to be quite real, realistic. I mean, yeah, there are those gods who give me visions, etc. And there are there are a few fantasy elements. However, uh, they are still supposedly mm, let, it, let him go. Those are still supposedly uh, very rare in this game. Like it's not like in I don't know 
not even Lord of the Rings, but I know Warcraft that you that you run into dragon at and uh, at every turn. So I wouldn't expect this uh, this game to have dragon slayers. But anyway, anyway, yeah. I said actually, Cultures 2 has only little fantasy elements. There is also actually Cultures 1, which I didn't play, but from what I heard and saw, because I watched some gameplays on YouTube, uh, the first Cultures actually seems to have even less fantasy elements than uh, than this one. Uh, there are actually snake people in few missions in Cultures 2, I believe only four, and two of them are free mission, one of them actually being the multiplayer one, and the two remaining ones are the last two missions of the campaign. But in the future games there is also, there is uh, Cultures 3, also known as Northland, and Cultures 4, also known as uh, the Eighth Wonder of the World. And in those, those monstrous and fantasy elements are actually much more common. Those games are more fantasy-like. And yeah, probably the monster is, if I remember correctly, somewhere in the southwestern part. Wow, what is this road? Okay, end of the line. <laughs> so let's just head southwest. Hmm. Yeah, this dungeon is actually fairly. Uh, fairly easy because I have I have only two heroes but I am basically just against the wolves and see, you will see what the what that monster there keep talking about is actually gonna be but what I mean it is it is definitely far easier than the dungeon in the Norman mission however there will be there will be harder dungeons in the future Wow, another end of the line? Do I need to walk that much around? Okay, anyway... Uh, anyway, yeah. The thing is that this dungeon is uh, quite easy and since then you just have to wait until you uh, trade enough to get the 50 golden coins or have the big enough army to defeat the Saracen, so it's actually pretty clear this mission. Wow. Okay, so apparently it is forcing me to go around. I still have more than uh, half of the health on both the heroes. It is a pity that then can't take any of those things, like amulets, potions. But yeah, I believe in one of the next missions there will actually come in handy. Yeah, they are pretty usable in dungeons, but as I mentioned previously, in the missions where you are against uh, against a stronger enemy tribe, those potions and amulets actually don't make much difference. It is simply more easier to simply overcome the enemy with numbers. Okay, another pack. Yeah, the wolves uh, always tend to run away when they are losing, but then then they return. <laughs> ah. All right then. Yeah, probably I'm going the right way. Okay. More wolves. 
Okay, now they have beaten the army quite a lot. But yeah, 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 this is... I believe this is the road I'm supposed to go. Judging by how isolated it is. Mm, I, I really like this uh, set. Or, or the danger music of uh, of those missions. Okay, yeah, yeah, this is it. This is the steam. Meaning there is basically and uh, there will be a fire soon. And fire and steam in this game uh, are an indication that <laughs> that there is something fantasy-like and evil around. Yeah, this had to be. Uh, the monster, the citizens of the Frankish city were afraid of. A rabbit with fiery red bloodshot eyes was staring at us. <laughs> yes, <Yeah>, seriously. <laughs> wow. Okay, it's over. <laughs> yeah, it is basically a rabbit with uh, a rabbit with uh, with behavior of a stronger wolf. But anyway. The terrified citizens' joy was uh, great when we told them of our victory over the beast. The mayor happily handed us the gold and had promised, and uh, he had promised, and the citizens arranged a feast in our honor. During the feast, a few of my men made acquaintance of the local women and fell in love. The wedding took place the very next day. Ah. Saddened, I thought of our abducted wives who could not be with us. We would have to get the rest of the ransom as quickly as possible or else free them in battle. Trade with the locals to collect the money for the ransom. Uh, nope, I don't think I will. Okay, and now, oh, yeah, I got only one woman in my village. Apparently, apparently, this is this is supposedly one of the women uh, which was married to my man. However, uh, ironically, she is actually yet to, yet to marry. Okay, let's have another woman firstly, and let's build some stuff. Oh yeah, and also I need a farmer. So yeah. Mason shop, uh, Mason shop, pottery. I still can't have carpenter. Okay, anyway. Yeah, nice. There are some chests around. Yeah, here. Nice. I can place a building of my choice. Some potions, more potions. Okay, more potions, which are pretty much, pretty much useless to me, to be honest. Okay, another building of my choice. Okay, cool. Cool, 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 cool. Oh, we've got no builders, right? Or do we? No, we've got one here. God damn it, do we actually have a scout? What? What? What's their problem? Oh yeah, you need wheat. Makes sense. Makes sense. The farmer is yet to produce so, and the wheat production uh, from the beginning goes a little slow because it first needs to grow. However, then it is gonna have a good momentum, so it will gonna have faster. Yeah, there is one more town, an orange one. Benevent. Uh, our scouts came across a Frankish village. The locals watched us suspiciously, but, don't, but did not appear hostile. Maybe we would be able to trade with them in exchange for a small tribute? 
Just maybe. Wait, I actually got 20 coins. Oh, okay. Interesting. Th this must actually be uh, the money the Rome gave me. Uh, because I defeated that the rabbit. But anyway, yeah. Let let's pay them because no way I will be paying to Saracens. And they are friendly now. Yeah, and from them I can actually build weapons for coins. Yeah. Makes sense. Oh yeah, there, there are some more chests here. Yeah. Potions. And... Okay, a building of my choice. Is Benevent supposedly Venice? Hmm. Because if, if yeah, the placement doesn't make sense. But anyway... Yeah, we still... we have wheat, but that probably... The problem is... okay, one problem is I, I is that I don't actually have a fisher. Okay, so at this point let's actually make this builder a fisherman. And yeah, as for the other builder, let's make him scout actually, because uh, with so so few people, it's really annoying <laughs> to maintain a village. That's why I made it another woman. Yeah, and I am basically back. Uh, I I love I I mostly basically uh, make make a village by a uh, by a road, but wait this guy actually I believe he cannot have kids if if he's uh, if he's a scout. Oh, there's even some meat in the warehouse. Yeah, maybe it's gonna come in handy. But five meat, uh, you know, when you are clever and have carriers and well-placed buildings uh, then the meat production is actually something so efficient that uh, five meat is not even that much okay this guy is civilian now nice we just finished uh, we just finished the mason's mason's shop And let's have it with this one. We have wheat now. And let's upgrade this one after that also. Why is she standing that with the third wheel food? Oh yeah, I know why. Because this is undergoing modernization uh, or, or upgrade. And if a building is undergoing an upgrade, uh, nothing can be done inside. It is pretty if uh, it is pretty efficient to uh, have a kid born and then start an upgrade uh, because the kid can pretty simply grow up while the upgrade is happening. Because when and when a building is being upgraded, I can't actually have another kit. Actually, while we be at it, let's actually take both our heroes and little explore the sea, because the Saracens village is on an island. And it is a... it is... To be honest, quite annoying to fight an enemy which is which is on the island uh, because you need to place your soldiers there. Uh, 
fighting the enemy which is on the on the same shore as you is far more comfortable okay this island is, is actually pretty big is it this one we will see you will see what is happening here yeah good the civilian grown up Cool. Cool. Let's uh, give a born to another girl, and then I will actually have three women, and my people production, people production, yeah, people production will actually be pretty stable. Yeah, I, I could also build a mill. Yeah, I didn't think about when I'm where I'm gonna build bakery, but never mind. Where are those Saracens? Yeah, they are more to the west, apparently. Yeah, we are building quite a lot of stuff at this moment. Okay, there is a goat on this island. Maybe it is already this one. I think a part of their village should be at the shore. Yeah, yeah. Here is their ship. Their ship. Okay, and here is here is a guy. Uh -huh. Okay, apparently they can't attack my ship at this moment. So let's actually circle around the island. And how is it going here? Good, another woman grown up. Okay, a redhead this time. Well, I, I really love the colors, color of her hair. What's what's his problem? Anyway. Good, so I've got four women now. That's a pretty good state. It's a pretty good state. But it will it will be good to have even more. I don't think it is that necessary to make another ship. Yeah, there is a lot of place here around. So I can actually deploy my soldiers over there and stack them here. Yeah, this probably should work. Okay, their, their village is actually bigger than I expected, apparently. Yeah, let's upgrade those dwellings also. Hmm. If I attack from here... Well, they will probably come for, come for me. <laughs> Wow, wow, wow. Don't don't shoot at my ship. <laughs> okay. Wait, did the music actually change because they were shooting at me? Seriously? Uh, there should be a new woman. Yeah, this 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 one. Okay, good. Nice. We actually also have some new civilians. A lot of bold guys. 
what is with all those bold guys? Is it is that a new fashion? Okay. So there is one more civilian here. Now I should actually focus on finishing the food chain. Wow, not barracks. No, not just yet. Uh, but oh, where is bakery? I still can have bakery, but soon I will hopefully. Yeah, Miller is milling. Once he will be yeah. Now he's uh, now he's got ten experience points in milling, so I can uh, make bakery and well. Well, well, well. Okay, and it is actually pretty much about time since uh, my food, uh, my food reserves are uh, getting quite thin. I actually thought of maybe starting a village over here, so I can build my army from here. But I fear it's uh, it's too close to the enemy, so it won't work. Yeah! Wow, they grow up so so fast. Okay, another bold new civilian. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Let's secure the production of our uh, of our basic resources. Yeah, this one can be making tiles now. Okay, the music changed, so at this point things are apparently going pretty well. So yeah, yeah, nice. I'm also good to build an armor shop, and yeah, actually, what I'm also gonna need is, is gonna be to make weapons. And in order to make weapons, I actually also need what? I need religion. And normally, if I would be starting with the headquarters, they, the weapon makers could potentially use it as. Uh, as an alternative temple, however, unfortunately we don't have one, and for that we are gonna need, need to make an alchemist, which is yeah pretty annoying actually. Yeah, he can make wooden spear now. Yes, upgrade those dwellings for now. So yeah, I believe maybe those Saracens are gonna attack me in the future. So actually, for now, let's build a defense tower somewhere over here, yeah. Just in case I would be under attack. Okay, are you a new grown-up women? Yes, fantastic. Good. 
so let's make you a mushroom extractor. Yeah, and I can also make iron. Yeah, that will that will come in handy eventually. Yeah, let's make another wave of people. What is this? What is this woman doing? <laughs> yeah, ha, 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 ha. yeah. Now the guy already needs to pray. He needs re religion. Wow, there's so many buildings I could build. <laughs> Yeah, nice spot to have a beehive. Yeah, it's going pretty well so far. Okay, you are a civilian. Yeah, we need another woodcutter actually. For stuff. Hmm. Okay, okay, okay. Also, I believe I can slowly start with building barracks. Do I have any scout? No, okay, that's a mistake. I really could use one. Yeah, go and build a signpost around here. Yeah, that's it. Good. I got some new civilians and new women. Wow, this time with white hair white hair. Oh and and I still couldn't upgrade them. Okay, let's actually make those remaining civilians uh, builders because now I'm building quite a lot of stuff, so it will go much faster. Yeah. Cool. Wow, that building sound sounds so comfortable. <laughs> it feels so good. Okay, her path is definitely gonna be needed. And are they missing anything here? Normal stone? There's a lot of it, a lot of it here. What's the problem? Yeah, he's already taking it taking it there. Got this beehive, this brewery. Actually, at this point, we are waiting for people to grow up. Yeah, it already seems like a pretty lot of people. Yeah, Barax is also also do uh, almost done. I believe I can start upgrading those dwellings. Another bald civilian grown up. I really don't know what is up with all those uh, bald people. So yeah, let's switch positions. Let's find a homeless woman, yeah this one, nice, nice, nice. 
are there any more homeless women? No, actually, I've got nine of them. Okay, then let's make one. <laughs> okay, you have a boy, you have a boy, you have a boy, you have a boy, and you have a boy. Everybody gets a boy. What we could do would be to actually set some landing spot for uh, for the soldiers and uh, make a make a fissure there, so we can be fishing in the meantime. Yeah, mushroom extractor, great. Cool, 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 cool. cool. Do we have a brewer? Yes, we got apparently. Let's actually also build a level 2 bakery. Is there any place left for... No, it isn't. Hmm. Yeah, so they will be going a little bit far, but whatever. Yeah, actually we could also use a school. And... Blacksmith... So yeah... You'll be fishing here, it's your new job. Hopefully the Saracens won't kill you. I am getting a little bit paranoid from this black area. So let's explore it while we'll be able to. Wait, someone is actually hungry. Okay, then the second bakery will, is definitely needed. I, yeah, it will take a little time till I be able to build Alchemist's hut, but since it when it's gonna be done, I th think I'll be actually good to start producing weapons and a serious army. But yeah, then we need to do something about that food. Yeah, probably the distance between the mill and the bakery is the problem at this point. And also that I've got, uh, I've got uh, quite a lot of people, 56. Wow, I actually hope they won't start dying, but there are bushes around, so it it shouldn't be such a problem, hopefully. Yeah, they, they, they okay, some of them are getting hungry. Actually, you know what? You can take meat. I can give them meat. So yeah, that that makes stuff easier. And I should have some new women around. Is that right? Yeah. Yeah, here. Okay, at this point, better let's not produce any more children. And let's stabilize the food production. Yeah. Yeah, this one can work here and yeah, exactly. This one can work here. So hopefully we we are gonna stop the famine like this. Still can't build alchemist hut. No, but it will hopefully be pretty soon. Or so it seems. 
yeah actually let's let, let's explore this area also hopefully they won't die because if any of those heroes get, die this game over actually and I will to start from the beginning yeah but probably there is not much around Okay, okay. Okay, I should have quite a lot of civilians now, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, eight of them. Uh, carrier here will be helpful. But yeah, it's quite, un quite unlucky that there are not any trees around. Anyone die? No. Shouldn't be someone supposed to work here? Okay, maybe I'm just a bit crazy. But didn't didn't I I have an armor? Okay, anyway. Never mind. Yeah, in the meantime, let's upgrade this this carpenter's shop. It it's also gonna come in handy. I could also potentially get weapons by trading with Benevent, but for that I would also need uh, level 3 carpentry, which I didn't upgrade up to now. Okay, the situation... Situation become pretty good, apparently, based on the music. Yeah, let's make another civilian wave. Okay, you can become an armor. Okay. The herb gathering goes quite slowly. Okay, children are are being born. I'm thinking where, where am I going to build the alchemist shop wait I was actually able to make this whole village with just two signposts okay that's pretty that's pretty cool actually Oh, I didn't notice you. Okay. This fucking carry you here, you have nothing to do or what? Yeah, apparently he's a bit stupid. Yeah, but sword production will go pretty slowly. But I think I will just focus just on bows, that, that will be that will be probably much better. Okay, so you let's make you soldiers actually at this point. Wait, some civilians are still not soldiers. Okay, then go there. <laughs> Yeah, short bow, nice. Okay, do we? Yeah, we can finally, fucking finally build alchemist hut. Okay, let, let's build over here because I don't want to build over those mushrooms. It will be far from the village, but anyway. Yeah, and we definitely need to allow it on uh, in both. Uh, in both the uh, dwellings, yeah. Let let's actually you make furniture and let's upgrade it so I can make crockery as well.
Yeah, luckily, although this is a small spot, there is a lot of clay around. Yeah. And as for you, let's make you a mushroom collector, actually. Yeah, you can take a bow. Yeah, and you as well. But pretty much my favorite that tactics is just to just to have a lot of a lot of long bows. And yeah, now I'm making oil. I should also be able to make a temple. Yeah, I don't want to build it those mushroom. Okay, well, ah, uh, fuck it. Let's build it here actually. <laughs> At the clay, but yeah, it would be a nice table, ni nice temple by a nice lake. <laughs> so why not? Uh, yeah, I could use a signpost over here. After all, in most cases, there can find a way, but it is still quite a long, long way. Can't you pray here, man? You, you should be able to pray here, right? I don't understand this. Okay. Yeah, the women are already taking the oil. Maybe he seriously actually needs a temple to be, to be able to pray. And what are we waiting for here? Oil. We, we've got oil here. What's the problem? Yeah, one, one of them... No. Yeah, the problem is because the, those, those women all, always take them. Uh, okay, let's assign a carrier there so it will be faster. Yeah, but now the woman shouldn't be taking it. Yeah, they are already coming, they are coming. Yeah, that's it, that's it, that's it. And now the temple will be ready. Yeah, I didn't really want it to uh, build anything over those mushroom because I mean, come on, let let's think a bit environmentally. <laughs> let's be env envir friendly. <laughs> okay, so yeah, at this point, let's make more soldiers actually. Yeah, perfect. Now the armor finally can pray, and so he can make uh, he can make bows. And now it is just a matter of time till I will have army strong enough to face those Saracens. But I need to be careful not to lo lose this boat. I think it will be better just to uh, have someone to go with them to here. And then, uh, then uh, sail here for the next wave of the soldiers. Yeah, blacksmith can have a ch uh, children uh, kill, 
children children too yeah we could upgrade this one maybe I'm also thinking catapult could get it handy and I could I could build some actually I could build some I mean I pretty much like the idea Actually, assign, for example, Bjarni to the ship. Bjar Bjarni is gonna be the captain, and he will always take a pack of soldiers here and then return for the next one. Yeah, it will be a little bit annoying procedure, but in the end, it's gonna work wonders. Okay, the upgrade went so quickly, I didn't even notice that. Yeah. Here we've got the trained armor as well. Cool. Nine civilians. Let's take them to barracks. Yeah, it will be pretty comfortable to have them divided by groups. I'm thinking how many soldiers do I make to defeat the Saracen safely? Or maybe I can make an exploration attack, you know what I will actually... Or no, no, no. I don't want to lose those, soldier, those soldiers. If I would take uh, all like 10, 10 soldiers and attack this, uh, this village right away, uh, they would die. I could explore the area with them, but they would die. Simply not to work, not worth the effort. So, good. There are also already some longbows. Oh, by the way, oh shit, look, looks like my wood production is pretty bad at this point. <laughs> yeah, it is indeed. Yeah, yeah, and this guy needs to sleep also, apparently. So once another wave of civilians grows up, I will actually make more woodcutters. Yeah. I'm just taking a look on this guy because I'm not exactly sure how the mushroom work. Like, like sometimes I don't understand how there, there can be so many of them. But anyway... Yeah, we also stabilized our, our oil reserves. Yeah, we can also allow crockery in the dwellings. So basically what it means is that uh, they will use up less, a bit less food. Another group of civilians. Yeah, let's let's give a born to them.
cool. Yeah, in total I actually got 33 soldiers. This one is not part of any group. Yeah, yeah, I actually got enough draw the bows at this point. Yeah, catapult building is in the process. Wow, one of them needs 10 wood. That's a lot. That's quite a lot. Eight. Yeah. Are there any soldiers which are not part of any group? It doesn't... it doesn't seem so. Yeah. Okay, still the food production is actually not so stable. Hmm, three pieces of bread. Wait, 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 wait. Oh yeah, we could use another baker here. Yeah, that would be good. Oh, we got some new civilians. Nice, nice, nice. Yeah, the next wave of children is almost grown up. Great. This might actually be possibly be almost the last wave. Because I really hope that 50 soldiers would be enough. Oh yeah, we've got a uh, short sword fighter without any, yeah, without any group. Yeah, let's make this guy actually part of group number three. Yeah, and this wave of civilians will be group number four. I believe there should be another one. Or I'm not sh exactly sure. Yeah, and you guys will be a longbow archers. Let's make another catapult. Or actually, another, another two. Another two. Let's have some fun. That's it. Hmm. Those catapults can have carriers, <laughs> so they will carry wood inside. Okay, that's interesting. Wait, wait, it seems that they are attacking. <laughs> they are attacking. I think I just saw a red spot on the map here. So the ship soon appears somewhere around here. Right, wait, let's wait, let's wait, let's wait. Or maybe not. Oh yes, here it come. Here it come. Look at those bitches. Look at those bitches. Okay. Just in case I will activate defense mode. Look at those bitches. They are here. Okay. Wow. That was quick. Did someone of my people die? Wow. No one died. No one died. Wow, I'm so happy with that. Good job, people. Yeah, and we managed to destroy their their ship. Nice. Nice job. I guess now they had have to be pretty scared to see such a big army. <laughs> okay then.
So, 10, 9, yeah. Good, so I believe at this point we'll be good to go. I will just get some meat for those guys. Okay, instead of just going to that bravery, they are apparently trying to find meat on the ground. But whatever. Yeah, can we take a catapult also? Yeah. Wait, what is... what the hell... what? What? What the hell is happening here? Huh. Okay... Okay, because of the attack and there wasn't any food production, the people got hungry, apparently. But yeah, another catapult is in the process. Wait, are they both working on the same one? That's strange. Okay, where is the ship? Yeah, here. Now let's go for another wave. I think yeah, maybe I will make one more in the in the meantime just to be sh just to make sure that I will have enough soldiers. Yeah, this catapult will be pretty soon. Will be done pretty soon. Yeah, actually the last group can be short sword people, because apparently I don't even have that many bows by now. Okay. Okay guys, for, for your own good I really hope you got enough meat. Okay, and one of them is gonna take the catapult. Shouldn't there be one more catapult being built somewhere? Huh? Oh yeah, they are. They are just making an. They are just making one. Okay, good. Yeah, those civilians. Yeah, maybe one of them already grown. Okay, apparently. Yeah, that must be him. Okay, disembark. Yeah, and now we can actually make this group number one automatically. And we can prepare the group number three. I'm always following a simple process, giving them some meat. 
two pieces of meat should be enough for the starters so they will be preserving the food a little man where is the ship it is quite slow actually yeah and now we can also be preparing the fifth group I mean the sixth group which will be yeah it, it will be the sword crew okay one of them was sleeping okay that catapult isn't ready just yet but it doesn't matter Okay, that this is 20 people it still doesn't look so big but it will <laughs> uh, you know what I will make one more short sword group so I will have wow I will have 70 70 soldiers quite crazy right There will be worse fighting missions than this one, trust me. Okay, okay. I don't need to upgrade this one actually. Is the ship coming? Oh yeah, it's coming this way actually, yeah. What is I, I actually spotted another dot here and actually at this point where uh, where I'm actually having most of my I, my army uh, getting ready to attack is actually not that good yeah yeah they are attacking me again Okay, so apparently now their attacks are becoming more frequent. Maybe I will actually lose some people this time. Wait, no. No, what are they doing? I I get it, so they are attacking from here. Okay, those bitches. How many of them is there? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. I'm not giving this to you guys. Let's actually build a defense tower. Where are I gonna attack from? Hmm. Okay, I'm thinking. I'm thinking. Let's build it over here actually. Yeah, that's it, that's it. Okay, okay, uh, I must be careful with Sigurd so they won't kill him. Okay, and... Where the hell are they, they going? Okay, they... You have quite a bad tactics, guys. <laughs> okay, anyway. Okay, see the music haven't even changed. So yeah, now I can give meat to those guys. Yeah, I got actually also this wave of civilians. Yeah, their ship is actually returning. Wait, let me just see what, what's gonna happen with that, actually. What's gonna happen with this ship, actually? So it's just gonna dock here. Okay, interesting. Maybe actually 
eventually if they would lose all their ships and maybe they would stop attacking me. Okay, already 30 people here, but still it's not enough. Not enough. And yeah, another catapult is ready also. Man, but I'm I actually really do do fear of concept of losing all those soldiers with some unlucky attack. But yeah, I mean yeah, in case I fail, I can I can easily build an army again. There is actually a potential act tactics to actually uh, to actually spam a little attacks on them, but it's just quite ineffective. Okay, group 4 can become a group 1 now. Okay, 39 people actually. Yeah, in one of them there were already... Uh, there were only 9 people actually, but okay, anyway. Yeah, this is group number 5. So let's give those guys some mead. One more, and once the ship's gonna be here, they can uh, they can go to it, and yeah, I will give the catapult. Wait, why is it having only only 2,931 HP? Did someone attack it? <laughs> okay. Maybe the Saracens actually on purpose went the entire way to attack the catapult. Yeah, but stacking some soldiers on the coast to actually uh, build a big army, I, I bet the Saracens didn't think of that. <laughs> So yeah. So at this point I got two more groups here on the coast to set an attack on the Saracens. Yeah, we got enough oil, enough weapon. Enough weapons, quite enough food, enough meat, enough bricks, crockery tiles, enough everything. Yeah, probably those cr that crockery implementation really did indeed, uh, really did indeed spare much food, or maybe it's also because. Uh, because a large portion of my soldiers went away. Okay, Yarni, where are you? Yeah, group number 5 becomes group 1 now. Yeah, see that? Almost 50 people. Good. Good and again good. Let the hate flow through you. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, I can be preparing those group of sword fighters actually. Yeah. I had a feeling that this area is getting a little bit more red, but that that just a that was just a feeling apparently. Okay, so let's get them some mead. One 
get some more. Yeah, I think I don't need to, buy, to build another catapult. Three catapults should be enough, hopefully. Yeah, probably. I think most probably if I had the right tactics, meaning luring the soldier Saracens out and then finishing the village with the archers, should be actually good enough, but. But let's actually overkill them with 70 soldiers. Almost 70. It will be 70. I mean, 68 or something like that. Man, what are you doing here? <laughs> he didn't have anything to do. Okay, I forgot about him, sorry. Where is Vyarni? Yeah, here. Okay. Okay, 59 people. So now let's let's prepare the last group. Oh, it will be 69. I will have ex exactly 69 soldiers. Good. <laughs> That's really nice to have exactly 69 soldiers. Yeah, actually after that I will probably have a special group to work with the catapults. So actually it's gonna be 66. Hmm, 66 is also a nice number. Okay, where the ship? Yeah, here. Okay. They are on the ship, so let's go, go, go. Okay, they are sending another ship. And I got no more soldiers here. Okay, so now I will have to be really careful. Mainly not to lost my hero Sigurd. But yeah, soon a ship will appear over here. So I will need to be careful and activate those towers in time. But last time they were actually pretty badly organized. Yeah, it's coming. I guess it's coming here, not there this time. Yeah. Yeah, okay. If they would be coming there... No? Okay, confusion tactics apparently. Wait, what are they doing? Or maybe are they actually attacking Benevent? Like, even even that is possible. Okay, they actually chose to, to move further from the village. Let's activate even this one just in case and let's mainly be careful about Sigurd. Yeah, they are, those idiots are attacking the blacksmith. Hmm. Yeah, I guess I will have. I will have to let them destroy it. Oh fuck! 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 fuck, fuck. No! 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 Okay, my art rate almost stopped now. Oh, I forgot one soldier here. Never mind. Never mind, it needs to be fine. Okay, you know what? Fuck that blacksmith. I got. I got. I got 69 soldiers. Okay. 
Okay, so let's get ready. I believe maybe if I just move over here, some Saracens should al already be lured. Yeah, actually, let's uh, let's feed them before attack. So they won't eat and sleep during the battle. Yeah. Okay, seems pretty promising. And, and those idiots are still sleeping. Okay, whatever. Okay, they should be soon coming for me. Yeah, your people are attacking a hostile nation. Beware, luck can turn quickly in war and can easily lead to your ruin. Yeah, strong works. Yeah, that's exact is exactly it. Luring them out. Yeah, and there there are the towers, so let's actually put the catapults in the play. No 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 don't don't go there, don't go there just yet. Yeah, the, with a lot large numbers, the large armies actually can get glitched. Okay, so uh, so far none of my, my men died. That's pretty good. Wow, where are they taking those soldiers? Wow. Okay. Okay. Yeah, catapult is attacking now. Great, great. That's what I need. Yeah, this is what I need. Ah. Okay, defense tower down. Ah, this feels so good. Okay, but there will be more of them. Okay, let's make this hole bigger actually. Yeah, at this point it seems that they are quite out of soldiers. Yeah, there is another tower over there. Okay. Yeah. You you won't be uh, you won't be abducting my women, you fuckers. Yeah, unfortunately the guys are becoming hungry at this point. Why are they attacking the Palisades? Okay, another their defense tower is down. Okay, so let's actually move somewhere in the middle of the village with their catapult. Yeah. Yeah, and now, now actually, yeah, let's let the real destruction begin now. Yeah, actually, at this point, I think I will focus on uh, on this area, and yeah, there is another defense tower over here. I could, I could quite. I could quite easily take them with just the soldiers, but uh, with catapult. Okay, what happened? 
with catapult if it's uh, more comfortable tactics to snipe them from distance. Okay, but what happened? Did the game lagged? Okay, I really hope I can make it work. But yeah, sometimes it's apparently it apparently lags for a longer period of time. Okay, I really hope it will. It is gonna run soon, right? Right? Okay, don't panic. Just don't panic. Okay. It's... I'm sure it's gonna be alright. Because I don't have a safe state. Hmm. Let's wait for a moment. It didn't load. Okay, so yeah, I am basically recording like 20 minutes later now because the game didn't load and I needed to actually restart my computer because I couldn't even close the game with the magical control alt delete trio because I couldn't even open the uh, open the task manager because it was on this monitor where is the game which I simply I tried various methods, but I couldn't. I couldn't close it. And of course, the mission. The, uh, the mission is loaded. I have to start from the beginning. So I'm really pissed. So pissed that I will actually show you how to rush this mission. So how to rush this mission. So let's go. For a long. Okay. 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 Take the soldiers and go. Okay, go, 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 go. Yeah, now, now the assholes are gonna arrive. Yeah, yeah, that's them. That's them. Go, 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 go. It was too late, canonically. Okay. Okay, I so somehow started to fight my own women, but yeah, let's go. Okay, okay, fuck, I lost them, but whatever. It doesn't matter. I know where the location is. Go, 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 go. Go, 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 go. Weekly, sail, sail. God damn, you call this a speed? Go faster, faster. Faster. Move. Move, 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 move. Oh fuck, I clicked on this piece of sand. Yeah, on this fucking, fucking big sand island. Go, 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 go. Yeah, that's their island, that's a goal, so it's them, more here. Yes, and now go, 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 go. Go, move your fucking butts. Move your butts. Go, 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 go. Go, 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 go. go. Yeah, great, take this spot. Got them, got them. Move, get out of here, get out of here, get out of here. Quickly, 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 quickly. Okay, okay, okay. Go, go, go. And get on the ship, get on the ship. Get on the ship. Hey, where where the hell are you going? Okay, that's it. Yeah, mission successful. That's it. It is impossible that's to describe the joy we felt when finally we were able to embrace our wives once more. Two fucking minutes. Happily, we accompanied them back to the camp, <laughs> yes. which had by now grown into a stately village. At last, we could continue our voyage to Byzantium. We immediately yes. began equipping our ship. The community was sad to be leaving this hospitable country that had suffered so badly under the pirates. Hospitable Many of us had made country. friends with the locals and chose to stay behind. But as a crisp breeze brushed my face while I stood at the bow, I found myself looking forward to the adventures in store for us. 
Ah, here, here you got it, you fuckers. Yeah, by the way, there are three other cities. But whatever, I, do, I don't need those fucking Italians. So, let's take a look at their town, actually. Yeah, pretty, pretty pathetic. Oh, their lines actually moved to the center. Okay, then. Yeah, they got some ships. Yeah, last time I was actually destroying those buildings around here. So... It would be pretty easy. It would have been pretty easy to destroy the rest of the rest of the village. So yeah, so glad glad I made it in the end. What's in what's in the rest of the map? Okay, here is just some deserts apparently. Alright then. Alright then. Anyway, we've got it. We've got it pretty easily. So yeah. So now we unlock the mission Michael Guard. And however, next time we'll be actually playing the free mission Island Realm. Uh, there also. We will also need to use ships in that mission, so I hope it's not gonna be a similar experience. However, uh, we will find out next time, so for now, thank you for watching and see you later.